Hello everyone, I am tessellating hexagons and don't blame me, I took a wrong turn at the bathroom, okay? But yes, I am back with some more Billy Hatcher after like a two month hiatus, which I'll get into in a moment, and yeah, mission four, for the first time in forever, we don't actually have to worry about saving a friend under a time limit, we just have to worry about a caged crow and an emblem, a pit and a pendulum, an appendix and a conundrum, where am I even going with this? I remember nothing about this mission, and very little about this game, it's been a while, meany phony, what it do? Billy! The little, the little chicks, chicks have captured the crow that stole their emblem. emblem! However, they were unable to retrieve the lost emblem! Billy, you must defeat the crows to get back the emblem! I want to say emblem a few more times! Emblem, emblem, emblem! Fire emblem! Uh, diarrhea! That doesn't contain the word emblem, never mind! I... I really, you can tell it's been a while since I last recorded. Also, there's a sonic egg and we still can't touch it because we're still too poor. So, yeah. If you're, like, binge-watching this entire series, or watching it ages after it goes up, then this will mean nothing to you, but uh, I've been gone for a while, like two months maybe, because uh, I got a job, and as part of that job I had to, like, hang on, how, 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 how get Egg to be up? Because does, th th does Egg not break friend? Does Egg not break friend? And by friend I mean cage-looking thing, can I, can I up? I cannot up, but I can up like that instead, okay. So yes, I done got employment, which I, I've spoken about at length in this series already, but uh, early into my tenure at said job, I had to go on like a business trip halfway up the country for two days, and then I had to go back to that same place again. Oh wait, no, don't, ooh, coin. I had to, like, I had to go to the same business convention center twice, and then also, I was like, yeah, I came down with a cold, and then in the past week, like literally I'm recording this on a Sunday, the Tuesday of this week, I went to hospital because we thought I might have appendicitis. But it turns out it probably wasn't, with an asterisk around the probably, because, uh, well, they did the necessary examinations of me and determined there was nothing in there that shouldn't be in there, but that's, that was the doctor's words, and uh, and so it was just plain old abdominal pain localized entirely within my kitchen. And by my kitchen, I mean the uh, the part of my body where, like, it would normally mean, oh, like it would normally imply appendicitis, but it wasn't. It was just pain. Well, I'm fine now, and that's why I'm here recording for you today. And also because the Billy, hoo 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 hoo. I make no apologies for the noises that just enter your ear holes, unless you happen to mute the video just perfectly at that particular moment. But yes, the point is, there's been a lot of things, including a lack of energy for that matter, keeping me away from this beloved game, I just want to... Oh, we have high jump boots! I forgot about these. Yeah, now we can just jump high and use fire, but we can't use fire. Can't really roll up that, but there's no reason why we would want to, so let's just continue on this way. And so we're sort of having a good time, because for the first time since World 1, we don't have to worry about time limits, it's just... Go get em, tiger, and by tiger I mean chicken. Oh, I... Okay, I want to hatch this egg because it'll add to our egg Pokedex, which I'm st It's been like, what, two months? And I'm still calling it that, because that's basically what it is. Also, I don't know if I've addressed this yet, but the reason why I keep sort of running in circles in order to stop is just because, you know, momentum and egg physics. The physics of an egg. Oh, I, I don't like having to deal with these penguin enemies because they're, they're so good at making my egg go poopy poppy bye bye. Yes, poopy poppy bye bye, where you, you shit out an entire pop. And by that I mean poppy. Okay, so this thing that we've got here, it is as it may very well look like a boom. I want to jump over the fire if I can. I can indeed. Thank you. Thank goodly to the you. Yes, please. Hmm. No, I fell through the thing. I'm sad. So basically, I don't need to fight them again. I'm under no obligation to do that. Why are you following me? What's Octopore doing here? Yes, it, it, it's a bomb, and it's really not that useful in single player. It only really shines in multiplayer, because you set it down with the Y button, and you can see that it's a bomb, but all other players view it as an egg, and it looks like a recall egg. So it's the, uh, sort of the, the orange-looking thing with the fire on it. So, you know. Anyway, if you touch it, it blows up. 
is, is the point, and that's only really useful multiplayer for reasons that I will cover later on in this series, because this series will continue and will come to a natural end eventually, god fuck it. Ah, uh, there goes the monetization. Actually, it probably won't, because YouTube tends not to pay any attention whatsoever to my videos, which I suppose I should be- I guess I should be thankful. Can you tell I have never played a Star Fox game apart from the one good one, which I will let's play at some point, and that opinion is going to make some internet people very unhappy. But yes, I distinctly remember that it, um, it pretends to be a recall egg, or Rykol, recall, recall, like, Riker, last of our kind, Switzerland 2016. I remember it because of multiplayer and its usefulness, and I'm talking in circles. My conversation is rotating. I'm going to rotate my tires, which does not mean spinning in place in a car, despite how it sounds. I have no idea where I'm going, I'm just following the delineated path. I know delineated is a word, I don't know what it means. I could guess at what it means. It's probably... Actually, you know what, I'm not going to guess because otherwise I will, I will look like a fool with pants. End of thought. Well, we just made a fine mess. Huh, that did not go as intended. My combo, you ate my legs. My, my combo has been eaten. Why are we... Like, what is the point of all this combat? Like, surely this combat could all just be avoided by me not opening any of the cages? Because this clearly isn't benefiting me anyway. Is there a chick coin back there? I would put one back there, but the developers are clearly not of my mindset. Which is fine. This is acceptable. Now... Can I...? No. But I can go round and under? Huh. That is not what I thought was about to happen there, but sure. I got another chick coin! Now, how many do we have? Three! I'm doing decently for a change. There are more friends. It, has my commentary suffered from the, the time I've spent away, and now I'm back to kick some butt in Wild Canyon? I shall find all the lost pieces of the Buster Emerald here. I'm going to get those fools. I think they're playing with my emeralds, they're playing with the wrong guy. It's a donut! I intended to make that as like a shitpost Vine style video, just to take the piss out of some of the uh, more questionable sounding lyrics from Sonic Adventure 2's soundtrack, but uh, never got around to it because I have not been around. Now where did that coin go? Ah, it is there. It wants me to do a long, a, a long, a wrong. Badness ever, Dean, on a toast. A toast. One toast. And we're back here. Ugh, fuck it. Did I get to keep? I got to keep. I will take that with a sauce of your choosing. But be careful, because there are some sources that I don't agree with. Now, what's down this way, if I can go this way instead? Is it just... Mm, not really all that remarkable, really. I was hoping to hatch that purple egg, but big whatever from the test gallery. Uh, zoop! I'm just gonna go straight down here, because I can. Ooh, there's a green egg! We can... We can hatch possibly a Peliwan, possibly a Bibu. We, we had a Bibu in here before. So, you know, steak have a pillory. Um, what was I'm trying to remember, there was, uh, like, in Moldova's last ever Junior Eurovision song, ah yes, it was Taylors Have a Bee. Those weren't the actual lyrics, I just remember there was some fan website who was just deaf and misheard the lyrics, and it's, it's Tell Us How To Be, which unfortunately contains the word come, because that's how Romanian works, their, their, their word for how is come, in the same way that uh, in Latin, come means, wait, hang on, I, I know this. It means with, because magna cum laude. Yeah, yeah, I still remember my school life, which I shouldn't because traumatic memories, but hey, hey diddly ho and a popple of scomp. Somehow it's like nothing's changed and everything has stayed the same and my commentary is still garbage with the cute accent on the A. Don't you pop my popples. Also, I really can't discern any logic whatsoever whatsoever about how Pelly went attacks. It just kind of just goes on a fantastic journey. Which I can live with. We're just here to kick names and take arse. And so far, that's what's been achieved. Whether or not it's been entertaining is another matter entirely. Oh. Okay. Sure, fine. Okay. I don't know why, but yeah, I'll take it. But the My question that I pitched to you, you lovely people, is where is the final coin? Did I pass it already? Is it in the local vicinity? With the cute accent that doesn't need to be there because I'm trying to look fancy and failing this isn't. Tame Pallywood. Pallywen. Pallyshay. 
belly dancing. Well, this was a hot mess. I'm going to grab this and forget this ever happened. Because you would have thought, bearing in mind that uh, we've had story progress recently. Also, good morning to you too, Billy. It is actually 20 past nine at night, but whatever. You know, I totally don't have a case of the Mondays or anything because it's Sunday night, but uh, whatever. So how badly did I do there? Because I am... I'm rusty, give me a break! But, yeah, what was I... Wow, I forgot what I was just saying. Why do y'all listen to me? What compels you to consume my content? Oh yeah, so we've made story progress. We know we're supposed to be going to San Bruin, yet here we are, conti oh, fireworks party, continuing to tit around in Circus Park. And, ooh, it's nighttime, but it's not nighttime, but it is nighttime. Like, they clearly weren't thinking when they designed this mission. Mini Funi, what is, what happens? What, what is the, the penis of occurrence? What's going on? Is there a, can I, can I look over here? Is there anything of interest happening down there? There might be, I don't know, there you are. Billy, Billy, it looks, it looks like, like the little, little chick, chick at the bottom of this hill is troubled by something. something. Could, could you listen, listen to his problems, problems and see what you could do to help him? That kind of reminds me. There aren't many female chickens, or at least female described chickens in this world. And also, I'm going to do a big stupid. Go to the bottom of this hill. How about I don't? Is there secrets down here? I, I see a glowing pot. I'm inclined to think there may be a coin inside. The game wants me to stupid and I stoked as desired. But yeah, so there, there doesn't seem to be much in the way of female chickenry. Like, all we've had is chain smoker pony, and that's all we've had to go on. So, unless there are others who just haven't actively campaigned about their femininity. But the, the reason why I bring this up is it reminds me of Spyro the Dragon, uh, which I, I, I finally bought the Reignited Trilogy the other day, because it was, it, was it was part of the sale. And so far it's lived up to all of my negative expectations. Like, it's still good, and they're... You know, their hearts were in the right place when they were making it. I really can't complain about, like, well, I can complain about the aesthetics because it's much too cartoony and I've never seen Spyro as a cartoony series, so I'm not sure whose idea that was, but whatever. But other than that, basically all my criticisms are correct. <laughs> like, there's, there's good stuff, there's also stuff that could have been improved upon, but... but it's, it's, it's like a 6 or 7 out of 10, but it still holds up. But, like, if you want to play good Spyro, just... just... Why bother paying over the odds for a remake when you can just play the original? What I will give credit for, though, apart from what I just mentioned, is also... Can I get into canon? Can I can I enter canon? If we'd gone to the bottom of the hill, then maybe we would know if I'm supposed to get into canon. Ha. Huh. Hey, hey, that... that I feel like that wasn't supposed to work, but hey. So did I just... Did I just skip? Did I skip everything? Well, now you're saying I should go this way, but... There's stuff this way, though. Okay, never mind. Bye bye. <laughs> Tragic. Okay, we're up here again. So let's just do this level properly this time, because uh, that was that sure was a diversion. Oh, I get it. Oh, it's one of these missions, I think. He says, deliberately not alluding to whatever it is he's about to say. I think we need to escort that bomb and put it into the thing we like the cannon we just spoke to. Clearly, we spoke to the cannon. Anyway. I don't get these fireworks to the cannon, the fireworks you don't get start. Really, can I ask you a favor? Can you take these fireworks to the fireworks cannon for me? If any crows were to destroy the fireworks, we're just burning them. Now it's no. You better be careful. Escort mission, my favorite. Could you not? Please not. Please do less of this. And as I say, oh, if the crows attack it, no word on whether. Richie's ice attack has any impact. Also, I'm sure that the, these penguin friends have gone through the, the fireworks. Like, is that death? That is death! Wow. There is only one firework to play with. I'm having fun. <laughs> uh, but no, it, it, enough tittying around. Tittying around as, as opposed to the regular. As opposed to the regular. Just that, that is all. So clearly the order of the day, as has been the case in previous such missions, is just clear out the path ahead of time. Obviously, don't go through the entire level like I did with, um, ooh, there's stuff down there. Like, don't do what I did when we were doing the get all the coins minigame in Forest Village. Like, don't go through the entire level and do, like, two laps just so you can escort the bomb safely, because then you'll get a terrible rank and it won't be entertaining to watch if you're recording it for YouTube. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge, wink, wink, face. Yes, wink, wink, face. But, like, just leave the bomb somewhere safe. I keep calling it a bomb. Technically, it's fireworks. Whatever. Leave, leave the uh, 
the escortee somewhere safe and clean stuff out ahead of time. And hopefully it's hopefully it behaves like an egg. So if a crow attacks it, it explodes. But if I like bounce it on the ground, hopefully it. W oh, why are you here? I don't like you. Boink. Oh no! No, 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 no. Less of this. Ah no! Why is everything bad? I could go around that way, but could I not just like go around like here instead? As it, running around in circles, somehow easier to. Oh no, I missed! What was that voice? Why are there so many friends? It's so many... Underwears. Can I just leave? Bye bye. Okay. Uh... Poo? Poo. Okay, so... That was speedrunning tactics that went offensively wrong, and I think... Yep, we, uh, we, we, we made it without... Never mind. Okay, that's fair. I'll, I'll, I'll take that. I won't take that, I'm sad. <laughs> well, you know what? Just to be spiteful, I'm gonna see what's down here and hope that the uh, that the thing isn't destroyed remotely while I'm off exploring, because I, I, I saw those enemies spawn in and also technically I need to go and re-get that coin that I found earlier, but since that's right at the end of the level, you know, who has the arse to worry about that? Because you, 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 what do you think you do? You can't worry unless you have ass cheeks. Who do you think you aren't? This commentary, ghost written by an AI. How far back is this going to let me go? Like, how, how explore is this level? And I reiterate, the, uh, the penguin friends spawned in. So, like, are they going to destroy the, uh, the fireworks bomb while I'm absent? Hopefully they will not. Well... I don't expect to find anything down here, so I'm probably, probably, probably going to get to the end of here and then go back into speed up times, because that's so entertaining to watch. Well, it, it gets the point across that I'm doing a thing that I tried once and failed. There was so much nothing back here. Damn. actually got the, uh, one of the bad things that can come from an egg at last. This is the, the crow. It makes everything dark. It's, uh, not really a power-up. And also there's a bat that slowly drains a health, I think. I feel like I may have mentioned this already, but yep, that's, that's just a thing that can happen. Okay, back to fast. Haha, <laughs> speedrunning track tactics, tactics. Well, I guess I'm back now. So it turns out, or so it seems, that uh, it's not just don't let the crows attack the bomb. It's don't let the crows even fucking touch the bomb, which is dumb, but okay. Oh no. So I, I can like slam it on the ground or whatever, and everything's fine. But uh, if, if a crow so much as looks at it funny, no, you're dead. So hey, I did it. <laughs> It was painful, many teeth were pulled in the process, but I did it. This is such a strange mission as well, because it felt like there were multiple ways that, like, you could go that you have no reason for going. And hey, you, you could all die. Okay, just not be inside the canon, that, that's also a fun time, I suppose. Now, I could grab the uh, the emblem and end my eternal torment, but I, there was a... Is, is, is there egg down here? Like, I think legally you have to give me an egg. He said it! He said it! Thank you. <laughs> that, that, that's a good line. Uh, but yes, there was this over here, and I don't want to leave completely empty pocketed, so... Yeah, I could do this mission again and, like, explore the various camera. Nooks and crevices and crannies and fannies and panties, but, uh, I just want to be done with this for now, so... 
That was a good time for all involved, I'm sure. Good morning! Good morning to you too, Billy, even though it quite clearly isn't morning at the moment. Well, you know, it's, it's, it's whatever. Bad grade, probably, because... <laughs> Can you blame me? Yeah, that wasn't a fun mission to cover. I don't remember that being that hard, by the way. Just, you know, deflecting all of the blame. But yeah. Hypothetically, now we have no excuse to not just go ahead and tackle Sand Ruined. It was several attempts just to highlight it on the map. But the thing is, I kind of want to do a couple of episodes dedicated just to the, uh, these missions, which they look like they won't take that long. So maybe one or two episodes of me catching up with Billy's friends first, and then we'll go to Sand Ruined and progress the story. Okay, okay. So for now, I have been, for the first time in ages, and will continue to be, despite the many hiatuses, tessellating hexagons, and I will see you in the next video of mine that you happen to choose to watch because you're under no obligation to watch this series back-to-back -back in the right order or even at all. Have a nice life! Drive safe.